Hi, Bertrand here from Musculoskeletal Physiotherapy Australia. And today we'll be discussing about heat therapy versus cold therapy. What do you use? Is heat better than ice? And what type of injuries should you use heat or ice? Well, on today's video, you will understand very well on what to use uh, when you have a certain type of injury. So, firstly, let's talk about a certain type of injury. Let's say you have an acute injury. And an acute injury could be, say for example, you walked and you tripped and you twisted your ankle. And now your, your ankle is all swollen, there's inflammation in that area. So that's a particular type of injury. Or let's say you've injured your shoulder and you've got swollen and bruised in that area. So if you have an acute injury, you definitely want to use ice. You don't want to use heat. If you use heat on an area where there's swelling and inflammation, you will actually make that area even worse and that inflammation will just get bigger and bigger. So for an acute injury where there's bruising or swelling, you want to use ice. So this is where, for example, an ice pack can, can come into play. So this is what we have here. This is a, a particular headache mask, but basically you can put this into the freezer or the fridge and it will basically act as a cooling agent. So wherever you put it, whether it be on your shoulder or around your ankle, you can strap it around your ankle. Um, that will actually help to decrease the inflammation, decrease the pain and improve your recovery much faster. So remember, acute injuries, you want to use ice, especially for the first 72 hours. Now, the next um, injury, let's say that uh, you have a subacute or chronic injury. Let's say, for example, you have a lower back injury. It's hard for you to bend, hard for you to twist. Um, then, and if there's no inflammation, then you want to use heat therapy. Heat is a great way and a great tool to basically help to reduce the muscle tension and improve range of motion. So what we use at our clinic is we use something here called PhysioRub. It's a very strong acting cream. And basically, it's probably one of the most strongest cream you can get in, on the market. Um, and that will actually help to generate heat in that local area. So basically, you want to use this wherever you get the pain in your body. And that will help to, once again, improve blood flow. Now, when you get more blood flow into that area, blood carries nutrients and oxygen. If you've got injuries through here, blood will basically go in there and help increase the healing properties of that area. So, we definitely recommend either Physio Rub um, or any type of heat cream, or you can even use this pack here. Now, this, as I said before, you can put in the freezer, but you can also put it in the microwave, and that will make that whole thing very hot. And basically, whack it on wherever you have pain, and again, once you use that, it will help to increase range of motion, be able to move better, and uh, improve your healing properties as well. So, hopefully from today, you have a clear understanding of what to use, whether it be heat or ice, depending on your injuries. For further information, click on um, the contact us below button and then you can ask us more questions from there. Thank you guys.